Oh. Oh. Get back to Poke Park, sleepyhead! Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. I think I'll be able to get inside this portal here. So let's think about wind, get some flying friends. Well actually we've got a bunch of flying friends already. And let's give it a shot! This should actually be pretty easy even without flying friends because of all the friends I have in general. Like even if I didn't get the ones that are flying is what I'm saying. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Get ready. Get your shake on. Pika pika pika. Here come all the friends we made so far. You know, in the arbor area. Ready? Steady? Not steady. Shake! Wow, look how fast it's filling. It's already complete. We opened the portal. <laughs> But let's see how high of a score we can get through. Obviously I could get higher if I had more friends, but not too shabby with what we have right now. Alright. Another trip into the Wish Park. Oh man. I forgot how spooky this place could be. And we're in a whole other wing of the wish park now. Oh boy. I'm off in the arbor area. Should be up ahead. Still, what's up with the tacky decor? The Pokemon who made this place has terrible taste. Hmm? Hmm? Hey, look who it is! Hey. Zora, I'm so glad you're safe! <sighs> None shall pass. What's wrong? You seem strange. Zora doesn't recognize you. Her again. It's you! I can't believe you made it here. Zora, chase them off. Zora, it's me! Hey, don't you recognize me? I'll take that as a big no. Alright, it's battle time with Zorark. Get ready. It doesn't really matter which Pokemon you use, in all honesty. It's not that difficult of a battle. You'll see what I mean. Let's just close in and show off his attack. Yeah, he's got that. Looks pretty powerful, but pretty dang easy to dodge. And no matter how much, no matter how powerful something is, it means nothing if it doesn't come into contact with you. And you're done, aren't you? <laughs> well, ah, so much for that. <laughs> Oh, my head. Oh. You even defeated Zorak. May not look like it, but controlling Zorak was really difficult. I hate to do it, but I guess I better flee. Be seeing you. You coward! Using teleport like that. Arr. Are you okay, Ponytail? I'll take that as a yes. Oh, what was I doing? Zora, did you come looking for me? Oh, Zora, you're back to normal. Oh, I'm so sorry I made you do all this. By the way, I don't recognize the Pokemon who are with you. They're Pikachu, Oshawa, and Snivy. They came to Wish Park with me. Is that so? Thank you for your assistance. You're welcome. It was a pleasure to beat you up. And you get two friends for the price of one battle. If that wasn't going to be obvious. <laughs> You happened to meet a Pokemon called Piplup, did you? Piplup, you say? The one who told me of the Wish Park schemer's fearsomeness. That was none other than Piplup. Oh, that's great! So Piplup hasn't been caught. So you're searching for Piplup. If that's so, let me help. Let's split up and look for him. 
Watch out for Chandelure. He manages the attraction. Something tells me we're gonna have to meet up with Chandelure. Yeah. I heard what Zorok said, but why don't we just tear, take care of this Chandler guy right now? Then we can make him tell us where Pip Up is. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so uh, another wing of Wish Park here. As you see, there's uh, a couple other places you can see in the background here. Uh, can we see the one? I think that was the one we were at before. Uh, yeah, but anyway. Uh, so, down is death, but you can't actually fall down into the abyss, so don't worry about it. <laughs> um, up here is a return path, you might see a little ledge there. Yeah, that's gonna be something for later. Can't help dancing on and on, I like DDR too! Oh, you don't look so good. Um, um, have fun. <laughs> Ooh, Leafy, on my favorite Eevee evolution because of your elegant design. Everyone's dancing, very wonderful. Um, no, everyone's probably got one thing to say, huh? I am the one who can dance better than anybody, but I'm getting a bit tired. By the way, all these Pokemon you see here will be at the Arbor area after we free them. Yes, I am confident we will free them. Um, yes. <laughs> I think the oh, oh, Vaporeon! Oh, Poopers, that can't be good. And we're gonna are we gonna have to play the tr attraction and risk that? It was fun at the beginning, but I can't stop dancing, even though I'm so tired. <laughs> I dance, your dance. Yep, this all it sounds very much like DDR. You just can't stop playing it once you start. <laughs> anyway. Uh oh, got some lackeys here. Litwick. I won't let you leave Wish Park. You're here forever and ever and ever. <laughs> Copy pasta. <laughs> Be mesmerized by Chandelure's dance. <laughs> Figures. Okay, I'm gonna assume the other ones have the same thing to say. <laughs> My stars, what brings you to the dance zone, kids? Oh, I've got it. You kids want to dance in my attraction? Dance Inferno? Any relation to Disco Inferno? Oh, come on, you knew that was coming. <laughs> Shut down this tacky, gaudy attraction and return everyone from the Arbor area to us. <sighs> tacky? How dare you disrespect my... I clicked through that too fast, I'm sorry. <laughs> Like I never shut my attraction down, got it? The only way to return them to normal is the sound of the wish bell. And it's over there across the bridge, which we don't have access to yet. How will we get access to it? If you want to ring it, you have to get through my dance inferno. Ah, oh, figures. We have to risk ourselves with unlimited dance moves. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Dance inferno. Dance like Lil Punny. Dance well and you'll get everybody's attention. How to play one. Hold the wheel up vertically and dance just like Lil Punny. Start dancing to the music when the dancing symbols start appearing. When a pose symbol comes by, strike a pose at the right time. So yeah, it's all about the timing. It's a rhythm game of sorts. No, not like DDR. It's different. And I am not very good at this mini game. <laughs> anyway, since we just got Snivy as a pal, let's use her since she seems to know her <clears throat> way around some decor. Yeah, like critiquing a chandelier and whatnot. <laughs> Alright, here we go! <laughs> Let's dance! Alright, remember, hold it vertically. Just, you, you think about the snaps of your wrist more than anything to get the timing of this. See the beat? Do, 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 do. And you want to get greats on each of those markers, if at all possible. Good is okay, but it's not going to be as high as greats are. Oh, come on! <laughs> I told you I'm not very good at this game. And mid-air twirl, mid-air twirl, mid-air twirl, mid-air twirl, ah, oh, poopers. <laughs> and this is coming from someone who can AAA DDR songs. Well, not all of them, but still, I'm saying that I have a, a good sense of rhythm overall. <laughs> it's just this game. I don't know why, I just don't have a grasp on it for some reason. But, I mean, I get the concept of it. Like, you can tell that I get greats here and there. 
Come on, focus, focus, get lower, high, low, swirl. Okay, okay, oh, 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 okay, we've got this, we've got this. See what I mean? I've got, I've got rhythm. I just don't have, there's just something about this mini game that does not work well with me. <laughs> anyway, I've definitely got the target score here. I do it good enough to get ye old target score. And uh, yeah, the Pokémon on screen there give you an idea of how you should be doing the moves. Yeah. Alright, good enough. <laughs> and that's why it's a dance inferno. Woo! Well, it looks like we haven't broke out in constant, uncontrollable dance, so that must mean that we didn't play it enough to break out into, I should say, be entranced by this attraction. So, we've also unlocked it for multiplayer. <laughs> so, it looks like we are good to go here. Hmm? Ah, I've had it! I can't believe these kids know the essence of dance. <laughs> and it moves off to the side. You guys are gonna say the same thing? Uh, yeah, I figured you would, so I'm not, not gonna bother you. <laughs> Think you're going to stroll up and ring that bell? You're sorely mistaken. Or sorely mistaken, excuse me. <clears throat> The dance may be done, but this party's not over yet. If you want to ring the wish bell, you have to get by me. It's boss battle time, baby. Got a special loading screen just for it. Well, it's more for the serious parts of the game, I guess you could say. All right, here we go. Dance Inferno part two. <laughs> the Disco Inferno. No, I'm just <laughs> All right, let's destroy the stuff. Starting with the spotlights. Get ready. And go. Wait, was I using Pikachu before? I don't think I was. I don't know, I wasn't paying much attention. I don't think I was using Pikachu. I could have been. Well, maybe, yeah, maybe I was. I wasn't paying much attention, I guess. <laughs> it's not that big of a deal, but... All, all Pokemon will do well in this boss battle. Oh, jeez, speakers! Mm. No, it, this, the hitboxes of these speakers are really weird. <laughs> it's like you gotta hit them uh, where the shadow is. If that... Any, see, look at that. Look at that. I'm not... <laughs> I don't really get the, the hitboxes of the speakers. I mean, I'm sure there's a way to uh, master it. Mm. Mm. I'm just using the Iron Tail because it's, it's fast. Mm. Oh, pain! <laughs> They don't do all that much damage, like any of Chandelure's stuff, but it but it accumulates basically. Anyway, uh, gotta get one more speaker out of here. There we go. All right. Oh, it is the Disco Inferno. <laughs> Take on that ball. Oh, wanted to jump off the side. My D-pad failed me. No, actually, it's fine. <laughs> Ow, pain. No, oh, Zorark. Knock that disco ball for a loop. I don't know how much HP it's got, but it homes in on you much better than anything else around here. When it does that charge attack. There we go. Woo! Victory goes to an electric mouse. Why aren't you a useless lot? It looks like I have to do this myself. How could you call me useless when I managed to foil your plan up to this point? It's, it's illogical. <laughs> Alright, Chandelure. Bring it on. Part three of this boss begins right here, right now. What you got? Guess that's a rapid spin. At least it seemed like it. Can I just do that, like, infinitely? I would very much appreciate being able to do that infinitely. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> yeah. By the way, yeah, you can do Iron Tails like that in the air if you so desire. Yeah. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, big attack, big attack. It's calling in reinforcements. Ah, pain. Get those lackeys off the field. Ah, dang it. <laughs> Why don't you knock your own lackeys out of here so I don't have to bother? Nah, actually, that won't happen. Seems like teammates can't hit each other. It's 
uh, there's no friendly fire here. <laughs> anyway, come over here, just away from, well, I guess you can do that, I suppose. Mm. Mm. I mean, I, I could be using, you know, electric, electric attacks. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. More bodies. More bodies. Yeah. More HP. More HP. <laughs> I can't knock him out with one Iron Tail now. Uh, yeah, it is a good idea to divide and conquer to some extent, because otherwise you're going to be overwhelmed with a bunch of stuff going on at once here. I know I'm doing kind of a bad job at this boss battle, but I think I'm still going to win this in the end. Yeah, I thought so. <laughs> Thank you, free-floating text, for that compliment. <laughs> How do you like that? Not once. But twice, you rotten little black brats. Actually, three times. There was the Disco Inferno. No, I know it's. <laughs> I know that's not the name. Then there was the battle versus the stuff, and then there was the battle versus Chandelure itself. So you can't even come. <laughs> I'm gonna make you rue the day you crossed me. Having trouble, Chandelure? You don't sound like yourself. Oh, oh boy. All three evolutionary lines. Well, now. The Eco Gathers, was it? Another nickname! <laughs> I can't have you running around as you please. My master's plan is for Wish Park to take the place of Poke Park. Oh. We will gather every Pokemon here in Wish Park and create a world where fun lasts forever. Since you are interfering with our plan, we must make you disappear. Got the little L. Wait, what? Those brats are... It doesn't matter whose catch they are. Or would you rather I have you disappear first? Gulp! <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm sorry. How powerful is that Pokemon there? Apparently, very strong. Hmm. Do you have any last words? I say, bring it on! Gothel, leave those kids alone. Your opponent is me. Oh, yeah! Me too! I'll be your opponent too! Bits Pip up! He's okay! Just like I promised. Oh, so you're the little blue meddler. The one who's been causing so much trouble in Wish Park lately. I see. You're one of the Eco Gatherer's allies. And the traitor Zorark is with you too. What a nuisance. Gathita. Gatharita. We're leaving. But, uh, Gathel, you, you can take them out with. We can take them off the flick of a wrist. Hmm, maybe she's not that powerful. Can't do anything about it. Gothel does what she wants. Consider yourselves lucky. Oh, I'm sure we'll see them again. Gothel, she may be a Pokemon of fearsome power, but she prefers not to do the fighting herself. Hmm. We defeat Chandler and drove off Gothel, but. Uh, now we have to return the Arbiarius Pokemon to normal. Oh, that's right. You have to ring the wish bell. But that bridge isn't down yet. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Voila. Well, I should say the bridge isn't up yet because it came up from the, the bottom there. Anyway, is there any Pokemon to uh, check out here? Well, I could chat with you. There are two more zones in Wish Park. The Power Zone and the Flight Zone. I need to whisper out everyone will go back to normal, right? Hopefully. Are you at the Arbor or at Zorak? Yeah, I know, the Wish Bell will do. Oops, didn't mean to do that. I wanted to jump over <laughs> Piplop. Uh, I just want to see if they have anything else to say. Um, maybe not. Let's see, Leafeon. Hmm. Well, okay, let's go. <laughs> Are you ready to ring the wish bell once more? By the way, shortcut back. <laughs> and...
Now that's music to my ears. Now then, what's next? You know, Pikachu, we only came to play at Seesaw Beach, but it turned into such an incredible adventure. I was really worried we got separated. I'm so glad to see you again. Pikachu's been looking really hard to find you. Yeah, thank you, Oshawa. No worries. Now that you say that again, at first I thought I could solve this case on my own, but I feel a lot more confident when I'm, when I'm with my pals. You wouldn't even be able to get through this place without us overall with the jumping and the diff different abilities. I'll forget it. <laughs> and yet, you griped when I tried to join you. Uh, it seemed like you only joined us because you thought it sounded fun. Yeah, whatever. It's a fact that I do get a lot of fun things when I'm with you guys. <laughs> I'd like to thank you as well. Thanks to you, I was able to rescue the Pokemon I took to Wish Park. I'm going to return to the Arbor area and tell the area keeper what I did. Queen Superior is forgiving. I don't think she'll blame you. It's nice of you to say that. I'll see you in the Arbor area. Alright. Well, we should go back too. Huh? What's wrong, Piplup? I'm... No, I'm going to stay in Wish Park. What? I have to tell the Pokemon who come here that Wish Park is a scary place, and I feel it will be easier for me to help if I stay here. We each have our own things we can do to help. Really? And well, we finally found you too? Pikachu, are you okay with this? Well, Pippa did seem to be okay. This isn't Pikachu's call. I've already made my decision. Oh, wrong voice. Also, Pikachu is with you guys, so I'm sure he'll be fine. Well, Piplup's gone. He took off. Staying all by yourself takes a lot of courage. You need to be that courageous too. I wonder about that. He looked a little lonely. But as Piplup said, we all have to do what we can do. Well, let's head back to the Arbor area. Alrighty. Uh, instead of going the up, uh, I was going to say instead of going the other way around, I was actually put on the other side of the bridge. I'm going to take the old shortcut path through here just to see if there's anything that I can collect at this moment in time. I don't think I can. No, I didn't think so. Alright, back across we go. To the Arbor area. Yes, please. Oh. Hello there. Looks like we're having another meetup. Pikachu. Soon we will face the end of both Poké Park and Wish Park. <coughs> dark Vortex has emerged. What is it? The ultimate darkness that existed before this world began. Who caused this? The one responsible for all that is disrupting the world. Beware the Dark Vortex. It is about to swallow Poké Park and Wish Park. Pikachu, the fate of those two worlds depends on the actions of you and your pals. Join forces with your pals. Stop the vortex and save us all. Why can't you do anything about it, Mr. Legendary? <laughs> I thank you for saving the Arborarius Pokemon. What's this? What's wrong, Pikachu? That's a glum look. Pikachu's friend stayed behind in Wish Park by himself. Is that so? That is worrisome indeed. What is that? That's not all? You've met a giant black Pokemon in the space between the two worlds? It couldn't be. The legend? Zekrom? And Zekrom said what? That, that the Dark Vortex has appeared in Poké Park? The Dark Vortex? According to the legend, it's a black vortex, big enough to swallow up the whole world. No way! Wish Park is a big enough problem. And now Poké Park might be destroyed too? Be calm, Oshawa. The legend also says, The world's rules waver, and a dark vortex appears in the sky. The actions of the Wish Park schemers and Zekrom's warning, it's likely that they are related. May I interrupt? When I was in Wish Park, I overheard Gothel's plans. They are going to try to befriend the Crag Area's Pokémon. Hmm. The Crag Area. There are many strong Pokémon there. They would be formidable foes if they joined the Wish Park schemers. So it's decided. Let's hurry to the Crag area. What? You're coming with us? Well, uh, I guess it's okay. 
I'll tell Crocodile to open the gate to the Craig area. Pokey Park's fate is in your hands. Alright, so the Craig area is now open. There are a bunch of Pokemon around this area now that can we can be friends. So before we'll go to the Craig area, I think we shall befriend the Pokemon that we can befriend at this moment in time. But in the next part. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you then. Yes, please. Bye-bye. Figures that it would still be stuck.